Hey, Genma the Samurai here, and welcome to this part of Metroid Prime. So, um, last part we went through the Chozo Ruins and collected junk, and now we're going through the Magmore Caverns and collecting junk. Um, that's gonna be what these next few parts really are at this point, just saying. <laughs> um, there's a whole ton of things left to get, and, um, you know, now that we have, you know, the, gra the freaking grapple beam, we can collect things. There's a very important item we're going to be collecting here, though. Um, well, a couple very important items. Um, oh, you. Okay, come on. Well, don't do that, game. Hey, when does that? Okay, so if you aim about right here and then use a super missile. Ooh, yeah. Yep. There's a Chozo artifact. So this one, I believe, is the artifact of nature. I don't know. Whatever. Weird chosen names. Yeah, that's what it was. Okay. This way. Eh. Right. Morpho bomb. Morpho bomb. Yes. Okay. Come on. Alright. Go up there. Alright. Ugh. Go through that door. Up here, uh, and through that door. Yep. Yeah, so you can uh, clear that if you have like the space jump boots. So that's pretty fun. Um, yeah. You can just as usual with these guys. I get so sick of fighting these guys. You can just use the ice beam on them and use missiles. Pretty much. Not that hard. Oh man, I've used so many missiles over the last few parts, like I'm looking there, like half of my missiles are gone. Ah. Come on, go here. Alright, and open the door. Come on, alright. And shoot that thing, there we go. So, all together, you know. About the usual right now, guys. Um, ah, wow, I'm getting hit with missiles. Like, those guys, like, really bad. Oh, yeah, so in this chamber, if we uh, go into more fall bomb mode and use a power bomb. Yeah, it's sort of a throwback to Super Metroid because there's a room in Super Metroid where you can do that. But look, it's another one of these. We got the ice spreader. So what this thing does is it's very similar to the super missile, um, except you use it with the ice beam, you know. So this is another one of the beam combos. Yeah, it's pretty cool to look at. Um, I'm not going to use it very much because, you know, super missiles are just... Actually, I think they're around the same speed. It's just one has a homing factor to it. Uh... Come on, this way. Okay, come on. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Just skip that segment. So I aim up here, shoot that, and yeah. Uh, I keep saying that. And yeah, just traveling through these areas as usual because. You guys are used to that by now with this game. You know. You backtrack a lot. Especially if you're looking for items. At which point, I'm going to just say forget the spider ball segment because... I have space jump boots. <laughs> uh, there we go. Ah! Come on. Yeah, don't do that. Okay. I am taking a lot of hits for like no reason. Um, oh, there we go. Nope. And I mean, one thing that I'm glad that they have in Prime 2 that I wish they uh, had in this game is if you could shoot your gun while you're using the grapple beam because, you know, you have to wait till you're like on land to shoot things, which is a pain. Um, anyway, let's shoot this. And, yeah. 
<clears throat> Let's go over here. Ugh, come on. Over here. Up there. Okay. There. Alright. Let's go into this. Insert into here. So there is a power up in this room that is uh, very important. I've already mentioned that power up that we're going to be getting. So let's uh, jump up here. Roll on this side where the green is. And use boost ball. Come up. I just also realized I haven't ever... Have I scanned one of the grapple points now that I have this? Okay, I didn't. So you need to do that for 100%, by the way. <laughs> it's pretty big pain. Yeah. Okay, so let's go in here and use the spinner again. Boost, 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 boost. Okay. And, um... Oh yeah, there's a magnetic railing, of course. <laughs> I forgot. And then, uh, lastly, somewhere around here, there, ah, there it is. So there's a Morpho Bomb slot right about here. I scanned one of these, right? Oh my gosh, I have not scanned. <laughs> there you go. Make sure to scan a Morpho Bomb slot, guys. That is, oh man, I can't believe I have missed, like, those, like, for so long. Like, that's really bad. <laughs> Um, so let's bomb up here. Yeah. Now, this is a segment I am not a big fan of. And that is mainly on the basis that, um, you are gonna be doing a lot of that. <laughs> and falling means you're gonna have to backtrack all the way up here. So, yeah. Let's go up here. And, uh, wait for that thing to get by. There we go. Drop off right there. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was close. Alright, so let's morph a bomb up here. Uh, Alright, there we go. Come on. Go down here. Alright, up here. Yeah. There we go. Yep. Yeah. I hate these segments so much. Because it's like, it's not that it's like hard, it's just like, if you do by some chance happen to screw it up, you have to backtrack a lot. And I hate crud like that. It's like, ugh. Okay, and then we drop off right about here. Make sure not to fall off. Okay, so then there's this power-up right here. And we got ourselves a new beam weapon, guys. It's the plasma beam. So, basically, this one is a heat-based weapon. So you aim right there and shoot. Yeah. So let's head over there. This is also by far the single best weapon in the game for killing enemies. Um, it just does so much damage. Um, the, well, I mean, the Ice Beam, if you can freeze enemies, it is the better option, actually, but um, I'm not going to be relying on that very much. <laughs> just saying. Um, let's see. where right, I'm going to go this way. Um, and then I'm gonna make a stop at, a uh, Fendrana Drifts, because, um, there's some power-ups I'm gonna need to get there. And, um, after I collect those power-ups, I'm gonna head back across, so, I don't know. We'll see how long this part is, because I'm gonna try and, uh, get enough that I can just head right back to the phase on mines after this. So, come on. Oh yeah, you can also incinerate enemies in one hit with this, so, again, it's pretty creepy to look at. I don't know, you just see them just burn away, it's weird. Um, but up here, we use Wave Beam, of course. Yeah. Yeah, come on. 
Alright, there we go. Now I got hit by like a second. <clears throat> yeah, let's head up here. Um, there's a number of power ups we're gonna need to collect at the Pendrana Drifts, of course, so we'll be doing that. Come on. Uh, right. So to the magnetic railing. Uh, okay, first let's go this way. Because we can collect something in the room where Thardis was, and uh, that is not really. It, it, it's about your average power up, you know. Um, instead of Thardis, though, now there is a full grown Shigoth here. Um, those things. I hate fighting those things, they take so long to kill. Um, but here we go. We got another missile tank. Yeah. So back through this. Um, and unmorph ball. So, over here. Come on. Ugh. There we go. Now heading back through this dory we just went through. And boost, boost, and boost, and boost. There we go. We're gonna head up here. Come on. Alright. <laughs> ice beam. Alright. Now you see this ice here? We can melt this ice now that we have the plasma beam. So, yeah. We got ourselves another energy tank. Yeah. We only have a few more to go, too. I realize. We're pretty far. Oh, there's music in this place again. I love it. Okay, where are you? Yeah, and also, it's a lot harder for enemies to dodge this beam than it is with the ice beam. Ah, I got knocked into the water. Eh, no biggie. Either way, I'm going to that one room. Come on. Alright. <laughs> okay, so let's head up here and open this door. Alright, so as you notice, there are grapple points that we can mess with now. That's very important to keep in mind. Okay, there we go. Now, is it this room that has that one stalactite that I couldn't destroy? I can't remember. Um, uh, let's head across. Ugh. No, it wasn't this room, it was the other one. Okay. Well, I've made an error. Let's try to get to that one. Gosh darn it. Okay, come on. Alright. Well, at the very least, I have the gravity suit now, so water movement isn't gonna be a jerk. Well, as much, anyway. Um, let's see. So then there's the gravity chamber right there, which is behind me. So I'll head there first. Yeah, there's a power up in there that you need the um, grapple beam to get a hold of. The pain. Like, I think this is one of those few areas where I think the backtracking is just way too far, in my opinion. But, um, like, if you know what you're doing, it's not as bad, but yeah, for sure. Ugh. Stupid things. Uh, up here. We need to find a spot where we can jump out. I must be around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, why are there so many of these invisible things here now? Alright, let's turn this on. Kill him. Kill him dead. Okay. Alright. Alright, let's not worry about that. So, we scan up there, 
Let's see what that is. Okay, volcanic rock. Ah, oh, maybe. Oh, there we go. Alright. That was a lot to say just using a thermal beam. <laughs> okay. Let's head over. I don't know, here. Okay. Yeah. Jump into that, and we will collect that this little thing. <clears throat> right. So let's head through that door. Yep. I don't even care that this like, disrupts my thing because I don't need it. Alright. Alright, so which one leads to the other one? Okay, that one leads back to the other thingy and I want to go to Frost Cave, so... Um, both are really good routes to get there though. I won't say that. So I'll just go back through this way. Uh, I shouldn't do that. I can't make that noise like verbally because it's like all techno stuff. Like, now without coming off as a flatlight, it's just not doable. Okay. Come on, up here. Ugh, I was muttering in my head. I don't know if you heard anything. Look. Come on. Ah. There we go. So where is the platform? There it is. Right here. Up here. Okay. Is this, uh, I think it is. Okay. Come on. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Through this door. Alright, now we're at the spot where we're supposed to. So. Oh, buzz off. Buzz off, arrow trippers. Okay. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go, up here, up here, alright, so somewhere around here there is, uh, there it is, okay. Yep. We can now go under the ice, and collect a missile tank, yeah, right. So, um, I believe we will head towards the elevator room, but, uh, not quite back yet. <laughs> um, let's head up here, and up here, and over here. Right, um, let's see. So, yeah, we'll go back that way. Hmm, okay. Yoink. Up this path, and there we go. <clears throat> so, in general, um, it's kind of crazy to think that I'm already, like, more than halfway through this game, I think. Like, I've only been doing this one for, like, a month. So, compared to some of my other series, you know, which one I'm talking about, um, this is a pretty crazy short amount of time. Um, head over up here. Ugh. Oh wait, there's one more thing I need to collect, that's right. Uh, I don't want to go back yet. So. Okay. Alright, I need to head to Fendrana's Edge, which is the end of this area. But that's what I consider this whole area anyway. 
just, I don't know, just a distinction, at least when I look up the theme song, you know, this place. You know, the more techno version of the Andrana Drifts tune. Um, let's head over here. Boom, boom. Boom. Alright. So this is gonna lead to Andrana's Edge. Okay. Come on through this. Come on. Yeah. Alright. Open there. Up here. Come on. Yeah. Up these platforms. Oh wait. Oh yeah, this. There we go. Come on. Oh, you. Oh. Jeez. Okay, I'm gonna have to. I'm just gonna kill these guys because they're not gonna make my life easy. No, they're not. Okay. No. All right. So let's go through here, all the way back up. <laughs> uh, geez, this is already going into towards the longer territory than what I usually do. Um, but I want to collect this item, so I don't know. Let's go grapple here. No, what? I... No! I... It could have been it worse. That's not to say that I wanted to go worse. That could have been worse. Uh, okay, back up here. Oh, man. I do like the plasma beam. It is very powerful. Okay, come on. Okay. I always hated landing on it before. So let's head up here. Ugh. Alright, I'm looking down on this one. Okay, actually, I'm gonna land on that one first because it's higher up. I don't trust platforming here. Okay, come on. There we go. No! Okay! I did not want to do that. Ugh. Alright. Now, this is one of the more mean things in this game. Because it's like, okay, there's a door behind there. Can I scan it? No. What you're supposed to do is power bomb it. But usually, you're given an indication that you can power bomb stuff by, you know, scanning it and reading that it's been desium. Um, you're given a hint that this Chozo artifact is here, but, um, all you're told is that it's pretty much here. <laughs> it, it's not a very good hint. <laughs> um, but regardless, there we go, we got another Chozo artifact. Um, let's grapple past this guy into that room over there. Okay, I'm going back. Uh, is that gonna do? Ah, it'll do. Alright. Yep. Come on. Now we got a power bomb expansion. Yep. So let's head back through this tunnel. And, um, yeah. We'll go to the nearest save room, and then we're gonna end the part because, oh boy. <laughs> So, let's see, is this the one? Yes it is. Okay. Come on. Through here. Come on. Alright. There's a door. Ah. Okay. So... I don't know what you were doing there, Space Pirate. You literally were like, hi. He's coming. Samus is coming. I don't care. I'm just gonna sit here. I'm gonna die anyway. I'm gonna sit here and just take it. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna save and we're going to end the part.
so thank you guys for watching. Um, be sure to tune in next time. Um, I'm going to keep item collecting to a minimum so we can head to the phase on mines pretty soon. So, uh, yeah. Um, bye.